Welcome to my kitchen, Kem Love Kitchen. Today I want to prepare native stew. And here I'm making use of my native pot or native calabash pot, whichever one you know it as. So I want to show you all my ingredients oil. Here we have four eggs. I have shombo, I have atarodo inside. Dry fish skin, that is pomo, salt, stockfish, flesh stockfish that I'm making use of. Here we have onion seasoning cube and open. Here I have olishi dish that is towel, liver, everything. So my blended crayfish. Here is my fresh tomatoes. Started. So let's start now. When you are cooking your native stew, you make use of your mortar. But I'm not making use of mortar, I want to use my stone. Now it's neither you use your stone or your mortar. So now I prefer to use my stone because stone is very, very easy for me. I don't like mortar. So let's get started. I want to use my grinding stone. Now I want to use my grinding stone. Now I told you I prefer to use grinding stone. So here I have my grinding stone. I'm to blend my pepper, onions, and tomatoes. Should be the last thing on the list. Mm -hmm. So I'm done with this one. Taste of the food very well. I prefer the stone than the blender. If I want it to be easy for me, I always open it like this and place it just like this, and you go. the last one I have inside here for the fresh tomatoes which I want to blend now I'm making use of my spoon so Here goes mine. I love the flavor. You 
Pytanie z Oliwy Stolicy. You can make use of local beans if you like. I prefer to use this. This one is very strong, so that's why I leave the two tomatoes inside the stone, so that I use it to blend it out. And I say this one is still strong and stiff. So I add onions. I told you that onions is the last thing I'll add here. So you see that I blend it, it will not splash everywhere. So this is the last one I want to grind now. my fresh tomatoes, pepper and onions with opening so I want to go and prepare the stew right now. I want to wash my stock fish, my dry fish with hot water. Hot water and salt. Everything is going right inside to go and visit the hot water. So we are going to come back. So I have my local calabash in the pot. I want to allow the water to dry. I've already raised the pot, so let's allow the water to dry, then we'll continue. I want to cook the stock, all the dry ingredients, so that everything will bring out their taste on the food. So I'm going to season it with my salt, seasoning cube, and onions. The ingredients, then I'll cover the pot. Oh my god, I want to check my food. If you're using this pot, you have to be very, very careful because it's very hot. It's 
so we turn it back to the gas. We allow the water to dry. The water has already dry, so let me continue with my stew. So now here comes my red oil. We allow the red oil to bleach a little before we continue. in the blended fresh pepper, onions, cocoa and uh, atarudu, shumbo and atarudu. Now we have onions inside so now we are putting another onion, a blended one bowl of onions. So I like to boil a little. 